a share of 250,000 Rand and the prestigious title of Brain of Brains is up for grabs in the Ultimate General Knowledge Showdown. The 2024 Discam Brain of 702. Better health starts here on 702. Well, a very, very good morning to everybody who's here with us at the Strelitzia Courtyard in Eastgate and to all of you who are listening live on 702 as well as those who are streaming on the Prime Media Plus app. If you have just joined us, welcome to the Discam Brain of 702. As I said, we're live from the Eastgate Mall. I'm John Perlman, your MC, and it is the ultimate general knowledge showdown in Gauteng. Our best and brightest brains are rearing to go. We've already seen what the Discam Junior Brain of 702 contestants couldn't do. And boy, did they do a lot. They were fabulous. But it is Saturday at last. We have all our winners of the week to compete against each other. And the winner of this round has a big prize they're playing for. 10,000 Rand, plus an opportunity to play in the final next Saturday. If you want to be part of the action, by the way, because it's exciting, it's doable. And I know all of you sitting at home driving in your car say, I knew that. I knew that. I knew that, and when you counted up all the I knew that, well, you might have won that round. So, come on, enter. Register at primediaplus.com and play the online general knowledge game. So, I'm here in this really wonderful part of the Eastgate shopping mall with some of my colleagues. I think you might know them. Bongani Bingwa, who wakes you up every morning. Uh, maybe you were awake, but you were wide awake <laughs> after listening to 702 Breakfast. Bongani is our quiz master today. Bongani, hi. Good morning, John. Uh, the quiz master, as you no doubt will know, has the toughest job in a sense because you've got to make sure you say things the right way. And sometimes the words, you know, I might say spell, spell left and you thought it was lift. So if I say anything incorrectly, no harm intended. I apologize up front. I will do my best. Um, I have practiced, I have read, I have conferred with people the pronunciations of some of these words, but it is what it is. English never loved us, right? So Bongani, um, <laughs> he, Bongani has been carefully watched because we have high court judges here. We have, uh, despite the fact that they're together in the mornings, uh, Jonathan Cabazela Fairburn will not hesitate for one moment to call out Mr. Bingwa if he made a mistake. Cabazela, it's good to have you with us. Welcome. Morning, John. Morning, everybody. And uh, we've got a big whip underneath <laughs> the table. And if it needs to be cracked, it will be cracked. Yeah. And I, well, now we're mixing up <laughs> organs of government. But uh, the chief whip is Tolakele Mganga, not only uh, by far the best sports brain in Gauteng, uh, but my colleague on 702 Drive. Tola Keller, good to have you with us as well. It's always good to be with you, John, even if it's in the morning. <laughs> yes, on a weekend. There we go. And if those two get it wrong, we do have a Supreme Court of Appeal. Clive Mouachi and Dineo Masheko will be keeping an eye on things. I don't think it's going to come to that, Bongani, uh, but you'll explain the rules in a moment. First of all, though, let's meet our contestants. First of all, he did the business on Monday. He was our winner at the start of the week. Minenhle Tebekulu is an e-hailing driver. He's 42. He's from Fosluris and has been listening to 702 since 1998. Entering the disc in brain of 702 for the first time. And he really wants to test his general knowledge, as so many of you, as I said earlier, have been doing all the, all the while, all the many years we've been doing uh, the disc in brain of 702, Mirenthle enjoys hiking, spending time with his family. He watches live sport, particularly rugby and football. Mirenthle, welcome. Give everyone a wave. Okay. I'm glad you applauded because you can't see a wave on radio. Well, and you certainly can't hear it. Our second contestant, the winner on Tuesday, Sunwabo Mpela is 49 years old, works as a quality assurer, lives in Kempton Park, has brought some Kempton Park fans along with him and has been listening to 702 for over 30 years. This is his first time entering the Discam brain of 702 
And he did so because he was feeling confident listening to uh, the, con the competition. Yeah, I can answer those. Uh, when he was listening to the, to the quiz on the station, which led him to believe that he could win. He enjoys reading, going for long walks. I don't know if him and Menentle will bump into each other on their long walks and listening to music and film. Sunwabo, welcome and well done for getting this far. The youngest, I think, of our contestants, yeah, Sibusiso Koza, welcome. Studying accounting at UJ, lives in Soweto and has been listening to 702 for over 10 years. Again, a first-time contestant in the disc and brain of 702. He listened on the radio and thought, I can do that quiz and win. Well, he's proved that. Can he win today, though? He enjoys playing chess, exploring, and trying new things. Seems like when you try new things, good things happen. Let's see what happens today. Sibusiso, welcome and good luck. Almost as young, but not quite as young. Tseho Kikana is 31 years old, works in property asset management, lives in Bryanston, listening to 702 for more than seven years. We appreciate your support over all those years. This is his second time playing the Disc and Brain of 702, however, the first time participating in the quarterfinals. He enjoys sports and cooking. Will he be cooking a celebration dinner tonight? Well, we're going to find out. Tejo, welcome, and the very best of luck to you. And finally, Sindile Nsibande is a 52-year-old admin clerk, lives in Cajiso, and has been listening to us for a long time, 15 years of being part of the 702 family. He's been entering the Diskim brain of 702 online for years. Finally, finally, it all paid off, and he got a chance to play on air. And he is our most recent winner, because we were with you yesterday on Friday, Sindile. He enjoys challenges. You've definitely got one today. He likes debating. No debating today, I'm afraid. Chess. There we go. You've got a new chess partner that you might consider after today. Uh, likes to study and is a DJ. Okay. Well, maybe you'll get to spin the tunes tonight and dance because you've won today in the disc and brain of 702. So those are our contestants. Let's just give them a really big round of applause. Let's congratulate them for winning during the week. Let's thank them for having the nerve to come and do this in front of a live audience. Pongani, we have our contestants. You have some questions. You have the floor. Over to you. Well, thank you, John. Um, once again, audience uh, that is with us here at uh, the Eastgate Mall, I'm going to ask you, do not mouth the answers. Do not say the answers. We know you're all very bright. Uh, we appreciate that about you. But if you know the answers, keep them all inside. All right? So let's just be careful with that. Contestants, you have 90 seconds. Unlike the competition on the radio, you have 90 seconds. And the goal is to get to as many uh, as you can, of 25 questions. 25 questions. Obviously, the contestant with the most correct answers is the winner. Otherwise, if scores are tied, we will play sudden death. Uh, also, by the way, a big thank you to Sandra Heldenhais, Luanda Pungula, uh, Vessel Badenhorst, and Neville Mudise, who provided some of today's questions. We really appreciate the contributions that come from our listeners. And that gives you, in a sense, uh, an indication of just how bright so many of you who listen to 702 are. So we really appreciate those contributions. Minente, are you ready? Ready. I told the kids to close their eyes and go la la la, but I suppose you won't do that. <laughs> it, actually, it actually works to relax you when you do something silly in front of an audience, because it can't get worse than that, right? <laughs> <laughs> All right, timekeeper. Silence, please. Timekeeper, start the clock. Three, two, one. Spell the word economist. E-C-O-N-O-M-I-S-T. Correct, complete the saying he did it in the heat of the what? Moment. Correct, how many N's are there in the word innocent? Two. Incorrect. In which province is the Addo Elephant National Park? Eastern Cape. Correct. True or false? In cars, the name BMW refers to Bavarian Motorworks. True. Correct. Which word means pamper? Ruin or treat? 
feet. Correct. In which African country is the Skeleton Coast National Park? Pass. In which South African city is the Market Theatre? CT, Johannesburg. Correct. The abbreviation IMF stands for International What Fund? Monetary. Correct. Which province lies on the Atlantic Ocean and the Indian Ocean? Province, Western Cape. Correct. How many colours are there on the Chinese flag? Two. Correct. The Scottish tennis player who won the 2016 Wimbledon title was Andy who? Murray. Correct. From which language is the name, is the name of the dish creme brulee? Pass. In which southern African country is the town Gwenya? Pass. Does the word implore mean beg or discover? Discover. Incorrect. Is Banjul the capital of Senegal or the Gambia? Gambia. Correct. A human pregnancy is broken up in a first, second, and third what beginning with T? Trimester. Correct. True or false, Sherilyn Sarkisian is better known on stage by the name Sher. True. Correct. In which European country is the city Copenhagen? Denmark. That would have been the correct answer, but not in time. So our judges are just conferring and looking serious and earnest and totting up their scores. Guys, have you got a, have you got a score? Yes, Tola Keller, let's hear from you. Minentla, I have to say, you are the calmest person that I've ever heard to answer <laughs> the questions. You got 13 correct. Thank you. <laughs> One three. So I, I just want to ask the audience, how many ends in the word innocent? How many of you got that right? Do you notice my hand isn't up? Those are the tricky, tricky brain questions. They really are, because you've got to almost spell the word out in your head, and you go one, two, three, and you've got to do all of that against a ticking clock. But well done, Melentle, an excellent round. Well, so that is the correct answer there. Three ends in the word innocent. The Skeleton Coast National Park is in Namibia. And what were the other ones? Creme brulee comes from France. Nguenya is in Eswatini. Implore means to beg. And Copenhagen is in Denmark. All right, so 13 is the score to beat. So, Noabo, you're up next. M. You want to try my trick? La, 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 la. You see, there you go. You can't get worse than that. True. All right, here we go. <laughs> Timekeeper. Start the clock. Three, two, one. Spell the word etiquette. E T I Q U E T E. Correct. Complete the saying. Beware of the Greeks bearing what? Pass. How many O's are there in the word glorious? Two. Correct. In which province is the Tanqua Karoo National Park? Northern Cape. Correct. True or false? In cars, the name Audi means I see you. False. Correct. Which word means peace, strife, or harmony? Harmony. Correct. In which African country is the Kafua National Park? Pass. In which South African city is the State Theatre? Pretoria. Correct. The abbreviation WHO stands for World What Organization? Health. Correct. The province, which province borders on Eswatini and Lesotho? Free State. Incorrect. How many colors are there on the Russian flag? Three. Correct. The Spanish tennis player who won the 22 Australian Open was Rafael who? Nadal. Correct. From which country is the dish called dim sum? Spain. Incorrect. In which southern African city is the town Shai Shai? Uh, Mozambique. Correct. Does the word investigate mean inquire or state? Inquire. Correct. Is Monrovia the capital of Libya or Liberia? Libya. Incorrect. In which organ beginning with you does the human baby grow before birth? Uterus. Correct. True or false? Reginald Dwight is better known by the stage name Alton John. True. Correct. In which island country is the city Havana? Cuba. Correct. Does the airline Lufthansa operate from Germany or Denmark? Germany. Correct. For which country did the former test cricketer Chris Dale play? West Indies. Correct. Which American city in Illinois is nicknamed Windy City? Chicago. Correct. So, what did the judges get? I think we are already in a very, very close race. And if you need a calm quality assurer, I think Sonwabo <laughs> is your man. If you need a calm e-hailing driver, Minentle is your guy. Um, after the show, I'm going to find out from these guys what the secret is uh, of staying calm because I'm very glad I'm on radio and not on television because you'd see lots of flapping arms and scratching of heads and so on. 
Okay, uh, judges, you guys look fairly calm. Cabazella, what do you got? Calm on the outside, but terrified in the inside. <laughs> yes, that's right. Sure, well, we had 22 questions asked. Sonwabo, you got 17 correct. <laughs> Really well done, uh, Sunwabo Mpela. Um, I don't know who's quality assuring your work today, but I think they'd give you at least five stars. So, we still have three contestants, though. The race for the disc brain of 702 in this quarterfinal out at Eastgate Mall is far, far, far from over. Bongani. Yes, indeed. I mean, etiquette. Right? Spelling etiquette under pressure in front of an audience. I thought, wow. <laughs> I, I thought it was pronounced e ticket. So. <laughs> All right. Beware of Greeks bearing gifts. Uh, and then, uh, what was that? What was the other one? The Kafue National Park is in Zambia. Uh, the province that borders Eswatini and Lesotho is KwaZulu Natal. And Dim Sum is from China. Monrovia is the capital of Liberia, and those were the ones we couldn't get correct answers to. All right, no pressure. Stay calm, stay collected. La 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 la. <laughs> it actually works, it really does, trust me. All right, you are ready to play? Yeah, I'm ready. All right, give it your best shot, my guy. Okay. Timekeeper, would you kindly, ever so gently, Start the clock! Three, two, one. Spell the word. Pass. Complete the saying. Every picture tells a what? Dif different story. Correct. How many O's are there in the word occasion? Three. Incorrect. In which province is the Halakhadi National Park? Northern Cape. Correct. True or false? In cars, the name Svalsbachen means people's car. True. Correct. Which word means prevent? Preclude or conclude? Preclude. Co uh, correct. In which African country is the Chobi National Park? Zambia. Incorrect. In which South African city is the Atterbury Theatre? Uh, not West. Incorrect. The abbreviation WTO stands for World What Organization? Transformation. Incorrect. Which province borders on Namibia and Botswana? Northern Cape. Correct. How many colors are there on the Greek flag? Two. Correct. The Austrian player who won the 2020 US Open title is Dominic Hu. Pass. Incorrect. From which large Asian country is the bread called chapati? Russia. Incorrect. In which southern African country is the town Hinti's Bay? Free State. Incorrect. Does the word abduct mean attack or kidnap? Kidnap. Correct. Is Asmara the capital of Niger or Eritrea? Eritrea. Correct. Give another name beginning with F for a developing baby. Fetus. Correct. True or false? Uh, Marshall Mathers is the, uh, the third. Is better known by the stage name Kanye West. True. Incorrect. In which Asian country is the city Baghdad? Bangladesh. Incorrect. Does the airline Aeroflot operate from Ukraine or Russia? Russia. Correct. For which country did the former test cricketer Steve Waugh play? I cannot complete the question. Big round of applause for Sibu Siso. The judges are busy conferring. Um, yeah, some really tricky, tricky questions there. Um, and lots about game parks. Yeah. Lots about birth. Yeah. Got some themes there. and Starting to see trends there, John. Starting to see some patterns. There you go. I'm, I'm wondering which is more difficult, going first and watching the people who come after, or going last and knowing what it's up against. <laughs> the guys are just shaking their heads, nodding their heads, and I think what they're saying is, it is as it is. And also, I can see people working out city and thinking province and going, oh no, a province and thinking country and no. That yeah. can also be quite confusing. I'm, uh, I don't like all the questions about food because I don't know <laughs> about you guys, but it's been a while. Anyway, <laughs> let's find out. Uh, Tola Kelly, you've been totting up. You speak for our high court. Well, John and Bongani, 21 questions were asked and Spusiso got 10 correct. Well Spusiso, done. Well, well done. done. Uh, you are not able uh, to match the score that is our current target. Of 17, but well done. You got yourself here. Uh, you won during the week. Thanks so much for joining us on the Diskim. Brain of 702, the quarterfinals at Eastgate. 17 is the score. Two contestants to go. The quizmaster is 
ready with the very next round of questions. Pongani. Before I do, let me give the correct answers, John. Uh, Baghdad is the capital of Iraq, of course. Uh, it is false that Marshall Mathers III is better known as Kanye West. Eminem. He is Eminem. Very good. I'm very impressed, John. Henty's Bay, you'll find in Namibia. Chapati is from India. Dominic Thiem won uh, the US Open uh, title in 2022. WTO stands for World Trade Organization. The Atterbury Theater is in Pretoria. Chobe National Park is in Botswana. Occasion has two O's. And you spell exclusive. E-X-C-L-U-S-I-V-E. -E. That's what we were looking for. Tejo, not Mudisane, but Kekan. <laughs> What's your trick? Uh, I've run out of things. La, 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 la. What do you want to do? I don't know. <laughs> we'll, we'll wing it. <laughs> we'll wing it. Yeah. All right. Here we go. Good luck to you, my man. Stay calm. Stay focused. Timekeeper. We ask you ever so gently for the honor <laughs> for the pleasure of you starting the clock three two one spell the word glamorous G-L-A-M-O-U-R-S-Y Incorrect. Complete the saying, a drowning man will clutch at what? Straws. Correct. How many E's are there in the word resettle? Three. Correct. In which province is the Okhrabius Falls National Park? Northern Cape. Correct. True or false in cars, the name Volvo means I roll. False. Incorrect. Which word means problem, conquest or dilemma? Dilemma. Correct. In which African country is the Hwangwe National Park? Pause. In which South African city is the Civic Theater? Uh, Joburg. Correct. The abbreviation EU stands for what union? European. Correct. Which province borders the Eastern Cape and the Western Cape? The Northern Cape. Correct. How many colors are there on the Belgian flag? Three. Correct. The Russian tennis player who won the 2021 US Open was Daniil who? Medvedev. Correct. From which country is the dish called sashami? Japan. Correct. In which Southern African country is the town Plumtree? Pause. Does the word hidden mean covert or overt? Covert. Correct. Is B Bamako the capital of Mali or Mauritius? Mali. Correct. Which organ beginning with P connects a developing baby to the mother? Pause. True or false? Frederick Osterlitz is better known by the stage name Freddie Mercury. True. Incorrect. In which European country is the city Sofia? Um, Italy. Incorrect. Does the airline Qantas operate from Australia or Australia. India? Correct. Seho, doing it with a high level of calm, but I did notice you were almost, you had a little keyboard going on the uh, podium where you're standing. Just for people who are not here and are listening live, we stand at these little podiums. The contestants come up as if they are delivering uh, the state of the brain address, I suppose. <laughs> um, and you were tapping away. Did that help keep you calm? It did, yeah. It did. You certainly sustained your calm. The key thing, though, is... How many did you answer and how many were right? Kabazela. Well, Tsecho, uh, you were very cool, calm and collected up there. You did very well. Went through 20 questions and 13 correct answers. Great effort there from Tsecho Kikana. 17 is the score to beat. Sunwabo Mpela is in the driving seat at the moment, but we're not done yet. Has everybody been impressed at how clear people are on what planets, uh, what, what countries' flags look like? Uh, uh, they just visualize, picture them. I've had to like, okay, figure it out. I don't think we've had a wrong answer on that. Not that I can think of. Yeah. Not that I can think of, John. What, but you've you got some details to fill in, things that uh, the, the contestant didn't get. Yes, indeed. Uh, Tsecho struggled with glamorous, which is G-L-A-M-O-R-O-U-S. Um, it is true that Volvo means I roll. Uh, in Zimbabwe, you'll find that Huangwe National Park. And again, in Zimbabwe is the country plum tree. Placenta is the P that connects a developing baby to the mother. 
And uh, it is false that Frederick Austerlitz is better known by the stage name Freddie Mercury. That belonged to Fred Astaire. Bulgaria is the country whose capital is Sofia. Those were the questions, uh, at least the answers, we were looking for. Cindy, you're our final contestant. How are you feeling? Yo, I don't know. You don't know. John asked the question, is it more pressure to go last or do you think it's easier because at least now you know what you have to get? No, it's more pressure because as I'm answering, I won't be able to count. <laughs> no, don't even try. Don't worry. These guys will count. Don't worry. You just focus on your thing. Yeah. Don't worry about the score. You know, it's a bit like cricket. They say, play each ball as yeah. it comes. Play each question as it's asked. What question were you happy you didn't get from all of these? Was there a question that you thought, yo? You know, to be honest, I was not listening to their <laughs> answers Good. most of the time. Good. I was just sitting, focusing. Focusing. You, all he's, right. he's in the zone. All right. You're in the zone, so let me not disturb you from your zone any further. Timekeeper, start the clock. Three, two, one. Spell the word indulgent. Pass. Complete the saying, one swallow does not make a what? Pass. How many E's are there in the word conference? Three. Correct. In which province is the Agalas National Park? Cape Town. Incorrect. True or false? In cars, the name Hilux is a combination of the words high and luxury. True. Correct. Which word means random? Arbitrary or duplicate? Arbitrary. Correct. In which African country is the Lower Zambezi National Park? Zimbabwe. Incorrect. In which South African city is the Baxter Theatre? Pass. The abbreviation AU stands for what union? African. Correct. Which province lies only on the Atlantic Ocean? Limpopo. Incorrect. How many colors are there on the German flag? Three. Correct. The Spanish tennis player who won the 2023 Wimbledon title was Carlos who? Pereira. Incorrect. From which country is the dish called tacos? Mexico. Correct. In which southern African country is the town Mariental? Pass. Does the word irregular mean tense or sporadic? Sporadic. Correct. Is uh, Niamey the capital of Congo or Niger? Niger. Correct. Does uh, name the flesh, the fleshy cord beginning with you between the fetus and the placenta? Pass. True or false? Marion Morrison is better known by the stage name John Wayne. True. Correct. In which Asian city? Cannot complete that question. Yeah, Sindile. There's, there were some tough questions in there. John Wayne, okay? Good stuff. Good stuff. And you are from the West, so yes. you'll be hiding, you'll be riding out West as soon as we're done. But will Sindile be heading West as the winner? Well, John, 18 questions were asked, and you got nine correct. Well done to you, Sindile. So, I think this competition is tough whether you go first, whether you go last, whether you are in the middle. I said all our contestants were in the zone. I hope nobody's confused. We are actually at Eastgate <laughs> and we're not in the zone. But you know what I mean. And I think they all did really, really well. They did well to get here by winning during the week. They did well to stand up in front of an audience and do their absolute level best. So, before we announce our winner, can we just have as loud as you can, a round of applause for all of our contestants. But in a good... Festive cheer, John, festive cheer. All right, let me, let me quickly give you the correct answers for the last round, because I know some people will be eager to hear those. Uh, indulgent, I-N-D-U-L-G-E-N-T. I should start spelling those actually without looking and see if I get them right. Um, one swallow does not, a, does not make a summer. That's what we're looking for there. The Agalas National Park is in the Western Cape. The Lower Zambezi National Park is in Zambia. The Baxter Theater is in Cape Town. Uh, the province that lies only on the Atlantic Ocean is the Northern Cape. 
Carlos Alcaraz won Wimbledon. Mariental is in Namibia, and the umbilical cord is the fleshy cord beginning with you between the fetus and the placenta. So that's, uh, those were the correct answers we were looking for there. John? Okay, so after a round in which we had good contestants, but we undoubtedly had one who was really outstanding, our winner of the Diskim Brain of 702 is Sunwabo Mpela. Sunwabo, can I ask you to step up? Step up there so we can just chat to you briefly. So, Sun, Sunwabo, tell us, how did, how did you prepare for this, if indeed you prepared at all? I mean, you may be just prepared with a good breakfast and turned up, but did you do any kind of things to say, okay, this is how I'm going to do my best? Um, no, not, nothing special, John. Like I said, uh, I always listened to the show, and I just decided this I'm going to just sign up, and here I am. Here you are. Here you are as a winner. That means our winner is Sunwabo Mpela. Congratulations. You are our reigning brain. Thank you, John. You have won 10,000 Rand, thanks to 702 and Discam. Better Health starts here. You will play again in the final next Saturday. And if you're still standing, you will be crowned the brain of 702 and win yourself a whopping 20,000 Rand. We're going to be out at the Menland Mall. We'll see you there. Hopefully, we'll see some of you as well. Now, do join us this time next weekend if you want to hear the winners of next week battle it out again. And if you want to get in the game, all of you who were hearing the questions and saying, I knew that, well, there's still money to be won. There is still your share potentially of 250,000 Rand, register at primediaplus.com and play the online general knowledge game. Who knows, you could be the disc brain of 702 for 2024. Be nice to say that after your name, wouldn't it? Thanks to 702 and disc better health starts here. On behalf of everybody, our team out at the Eastgate Mall, Bongani, a last word, do you have a question? The answer is true. <laughs> Bongani, what was the what was the question? False. Bongani, Bigwa, I was in the zone. Thank you very much for uh, your contribution as quizmaster. Kabazela and Tolakele Mganga have been our judges today, and thanks once again to all of you for being a wonderful audience for all the support that you give us at Radio Seven O Two. We really appreciate it. And finally, thanks of course to our partners. In Diskem Brain of 702, Diskem, it's been a wonderful partnership. Here's to many more. A share of 250,000 Rand and the prestigious title of Brain of Brains is up for grabs in the ultimate general knowledge showdown. The 2024 Diskem Brain of 702. Better health starts here on 702.